Welcome back. It's me, Neo. And it's raining. Really? Could there be any more perfect timing? Anyways, I I got I I did a few stuff off camera. So what I did was uh, I went mining, found uh, decent amount of emeralds. I'm not gonna lie, about four diamonds. We're gonna take four of them, and we're going to um make an axe. Touch it, make talk. Uh. Oh, the I just I was just told that. The, that that the lumber axe was part of the tier two to tier two tools. Well, no problem. I have tons of iron, literally tons of iron. It, too bad I can only cook cook, cook a very few at a time, like nine. I'll get back. To, to, uh, I'm I'm gonna find my smell tree. Oh, there it is. I forgot what was in here. A uh, uh, bit of tin. Let's put some copper and some, and I'll also put some iron in here. I'll get back to you when this is finished smelting. With a little crafting, I managed to get this to be automated. Thanks to a little thing called the redstone clock. To make this, you just need uh, four redstone, a uh, four smooth stone, and a redstone torch, which is five redstone and a stick. The simple clear block, I mean cheap block, emits a redstone false once a second. Which, uh, so it's automated. The only part is, there's a l I accidentally stepped into it and there's a little blood in it, so... Yeah, we, we have to remove the ingot cast, so it's semi-automatic, but not fully automatic. Here we go. It's getting to the molten tin. Ah, oh, I thought it was getting to the molten iron. I, I made a little bronze. Not very useful, but hey, bronze is actually my favorite shade of orange. Let's go craft some blocks out, shall we? I think we shall. Not bad looking, right? Let, let's make another one of these so this can mark that this is the nether. I like decorating uh, things. Or maybe I could make it. Uh, I could. Uh, I, I, when I'm finished with this, I could uh, make, uh, it, uh, and make the rest out of mossy cobble. I know, why, why don't we do it now? Yeah, that's a perfect amount. Not bad. This will be the best portal in the world, even though I think I'm overdoing it. Well, also, this kind of happens sometimes. And not, you can't do anything about that, but the. the oh. When it did a <laughs> chest. <laughs> That's hilarious. It went into the chest. <laughs> Maybe I should craft another hopper. I wonder if this can also be used to... Wait, what's this? Oh, it also used to make empty canisters. I forgot about that. I 
also let's just um <clears throat> let's just um what was I doing? Oh yeah. I was doing this. Then I put this on back. There we go. Iron. Yeah, that's plenty to make another hopper. That's that's perfect amount, actually. Not bad. Whoa, what the heck are those? They look like they look like technology they look like technology dragonflies. That's my best description of it. Yeah. You have anything better? Oh, I have to put it there. For you, for those of you who don't know how to make a hopper, that's how to make a hopper. Or funnel, as it's called sometimes. Let's see if I can turn it. Let's see if I... Let's see. Okay, so apparently I can't. And I went in there again. So let's just put all our iron in there. Yeah, I think we have an automation going on here. I'm genius. I'm a genius. Just by using a few combinations of of vanilla, uh, um, uh, 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 um, uh, um, extra utilities and Tinker's construct, I can I can get a tons of iron. I get I get eighteen iron if of her for stuff that's in here because the ore doubles. I'll get back to you when this is all finished smelting because it'll take forever. And we've upgraded our, our, our tool station into a tool forge. Yay. I just placed that down right here. Now we have all of this uh, stuff that we can craft. And the main thing we'll be using is the lumber axe. Because, well, I need a few apples. And this clears out all the logs, and yeah, so yeah, and we're back. All right, we have to build up our cobalt and the thing. Hold on, what the heck? And we're back. Can't believe we have to do all this work to to to, to make um. Oh crap. I can't believe we have to do all this work to um get apples. Really? But hey, it's totally worth it. I regret absolutely nothing. So oh yeah, I think no no it was in this chest. Here's my cobalt binding, and no wait, 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 wait. that's not it. Uh, cobalt Brodex head. Mm. <clears throat> uh. Uh. Um. Wait. 
where is ah here's the plate and then just make it like so there we go our lumber axe to even get pro tinker not bad let me show you what this thing can do hopefully this doesn't crash my minecraft Did you? Hopefully, I'll never have to. Uh, n n n n never have to like. Uh, you see, stuff is falling down. More wood. More wood. Uh, yep, this is that's glitched. There we go. That's it. Let me just update that for you. See the leaves are despawning, despawning, and that's happening. Not bad, not bad at all. And there's this one leaf that that has that vine on it. Huh. Didn't see this. Bit of a world hole. Separating the Two worlds. Chop. That's the one right next to ours. This is a great way to get apples. may be rare but hey totally worth it look at all those leaves that just cut that are just spawning I'll get back to you when I actually have an apple well I finally got one after a few wow long time very long time can't even estimate it anyways that's one step close to yeah now we get to make another jewel apple Took all that work to get apples. Well, that'll be about it for this episode. Thanks for watching. What the? Why won't it?